Hello everyone! It is Sunday and that means anachronism. Today we have Grettir the Strong, a Norse warrior, a Viking. It's actually very hard to tell, but his head is over here. This is his back, he shows his back to you. Um, yeah, it's a metal warrior, it has a grid over here, uh, with minus one and minus one on both sides. So. It has 7 health, 3 uh, speed, 5 experience, and 1 strength. Uh, it has the ability Sterk. Your attacks with axes deal plus 1 damage. Your attack rolls that are doubles do not count as critical strikes. Uh, critical hits. Alright. So it doesn't give you uh, crits, but it does increase damage with axes. Grettir, outlaw son of Asmund is the epitome of the warrior poet. However, ill luck stalks him all his life, as does a bad reputation. Right, for the inspiration today we have Loki, the trickster god, who was actually a giant. Um, yeah. Six initiative of the uh, wind element, and it has the ability Knip. Which is, which is a reveal ability. Choose an opposing warrior's face-up weapon. If you have a face-up weapon, exchange that card for your opponent's weapon until the end of the round. Because it tricks you. So it switches. God of trickery and mischief. Loki plagues the Aesir with his crafty, often malicious pranks. Then for the weapon we have an axe, obviously. The Dane Axe, uh, which has zero strength, three initiative, and it has an attack, and it has an attack grid, all of the front and one above the middle one. Plus once on the outer and in the middle, plus two. All right, two-hander. It has the ability Hogge. Uh, this weapon deals plus one damage for each of your other face-up support cards. Wow, this is a finisher. This is a game changer. Well game finisher. Uh, this six foot broad axe can shear the head from a horse in a single blow. Yeah, that's awesome. Next up, armor. We have a torso armor, bear sark, which has five initiative and it has the ability Bjorn. Once per round when you are attacked, force the attacker to re-roll their attack roll. Discard this card if the result is lower than their original roll. Wearing this pelt gives the Norse warrior the strength, stamina, and power of the bear itself. Cool. And finally, our last one, a special one. Uh, it's, it's an ability, Berserkerganger. Uh, it has seven initiative, and it has the ability Vrede. Your attacks deal plus one damage. You take one damage after each of your attacks. In a fit of rage, Berserkers and Ulveonors Tear through enemy lines with inhuman strength and ferocity. Yes. Um, what I understand of the berser berserkers' uh, rage is that they would enrage themselves. Uh, pump them, pump themselves up. Uh, but in the process, um, it often hurts their bodies. Uh, some will uh, faint or just die. I believe I've read that somewhere. Uh, but in the process, the adrenaline they get from this will boost their attack and pain limit and such. So, awesome! Berserkerganger. So, that's it for uh, the first of the Norse. Well, actually, the second, if you call, if you count uh, Harald Hardragda. But I mean, uh, the first in a row. We will see two more. And then the Norse warriors and the first set is done. And then we move on to the second set, to the British. Well, thank you all for watching. See you next week. Bye.